My name's Aaron Zorgel, and I'm a millionaire commercial composer. And when I'm not picking up mad checks for my wicked jingles, I'm picking up mad chicks in my Jeep Wrangler over here. Ding, 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 ding. want to come to this party come th come on through with lust 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 being such a more kind of personal and, and intimate record than your your past work now that it's kind of been out for a little while i'm wondering sort of what your feelings are towards it when you when you listen to it and when you and when you play it like have the songs sort of evolved for you uh, I haven't actually, I don't think I've heard it since we released it, <laughs> so I don't know, I mean it's a, it's a great album to play, you know, I mean it fits well with the old stuff, so it makes for a good live show. I haven't actually listened to it either, but it's, it does, it does have like a vibe to it that's different from the other albums playing it live, it's very kind of, um, got a lot of atmosphere. And more space in the music than some of the music we've done before that's very dense, which is sort of creates a good balance and, um, with the other, with the older material. Mm -hmm. like that. Do you often go back and like listen to your records? Like, did you like, no, not really. like a lot of If you're really drunk, it's fun, but not that, I don't really. Sometimes we, we like to indulge in the sort of the in the old B sides, you know, all the outtakes and all the stuff that never never was released on any albums. That's always kind of fun to listen to. Mm -hmm. But the albums, I don't ever put a Ravenet's album on at home. Mm -hmm. So I'd read, I think it was on your MySpace, you mentioned that Lust, Lust, Lust had already kind of was selling better than any of your of your past records, and that's sort of without, I guess, like a major label promotional machine behind it, right? Yeah, I mean, that's yeah. just based I mean, on... We worked, we worked really hard for the band for like five years, six years, you know, and, uh, and obviously, you know, if we keep continuing, you know, to put out really great albums, you know, it's going to pay off in the end, so... And um, so we just keep evolving and putting out really great albums. You know? mm -hmm. and people really like that. You know, I, I think people enjoy consistency in a band. Mm -hmm. I don't think they like bands where you know you put out an album and they hate it all of a sudden. You know, mm -hmm. I think we're really good at putting out albums that definitely our, a lot of our fans really like. And at the same time, I think we gain a lot of new fans because we keep evolving. It's good. It's really good.